Welcome back to more Worlds and Club, everybody. In the last episode, we completed the big finale, which we thought was going to be the ending, but it actually was not. Another big twist, of course. So we are progressing here a little bit more in this giant X up in the sky near Tokyo. So let's continue with the story, and I will be quiet once again. Let's do this. Anyway, we need to figure out where Vanilla is being kept. Yeah, you're right. We need to rescue Vanilla as soon as possible. But how are we going to find her? on it isn't getting us anywhere maybe there's a clue somewhere in this panopticon you're right let's split up and search got it <laughs>
If I don't find anything, I'm gonna go ahead and do a cut. Um, okay, I found it. So it's actually in the Hyogo area titled What's Next. I chose Osaka, uh, but now this time I'm gonna be going into Kyoto. Um, yeah, so we will go and select this. So we're gonna get some new scenes and stuff. So let's see. Alright, actually there was uh, no new um, like dialogue in that scene because that's the scene where you know we decide to uh, we're almost about to split up again but then they're like oh yeah we shouldn't split up again it's the same exact scene the only thing is that because I chose Kyoto area now we're going over to the Kyoto area instead of down but remember that in the previous section back here the party does actually split up into two but then they learn from that mistake and here they don't split up so we're gonna end up going towards whichever way I decided to go so now we're going to go to Kyoto, so now we're going to get some new cutscenes, and it's an act, so there's also going to be some gameplay in this one, so uh, we will see what happens. Let's do this. And so, here we are in Kyoto! Is this really Kyoto? Huh? Yeah, like, duh, it's totally Kyoto! But I thought Kyoto was like Kiyomizu Temple, Fushimi Inari Shrine, Togetsu Kyo Bridge, and Kinkakuji, Toji, and Sanju Sangendo. Yeah, and Pondojo, Ishibekoji Alley, and Gion. So, what are we doing here? This doesn't feel like Kyoto at all! Uh. That's why Team Osaka is so lame. You can't appreciate Kyoto's elegance. That's pretty sad. This looks like a place a drunk would pee! What part of it is elegant? Well, elegant or not, this is a famous tourist attraction in Kyoto, too. It's Nanzenji's Suryokaku Aqueduct Bridge, built about a hundred years ago. They filmed tons of two-hour suspense dramas here. Our suspense dramas! I hate those things! Because of them, they always cut baseball games short! Well, we've come all the way to Kyoto, but no one's around. Just like the other cities. Hey, Chuko! So where are all the people, huh? I have no idea. On the flyer, it just said, come to Kyoto. Maybe we should have gone to Osaka. If we'd gone to Osaka, we might have found vanilla. And I could have eaten takoyaki and okonomiyaki. <sighs> hey, did you hear that? Yeah, I heard something from over there.
What are you doing? Does it look like I'm making mochi or something? I'm practicing my batting. Why? Because there's a bat and ball there. I wanted to clear my head. <sighs> hey, Jenu. You heard it too, right? From the people living here. Yeah. It seemed like everyone was saying the same thing. What did you think of it? There were so many things that made no sense. Right? I felt the same. I just got so confused. That's why I'm swinging this bat. I feel like I can empty my head like this. All right, Rachel. Next ball. Go all out. Don't go easy on me. Let her rip. I hit whacked into it, and it came crashing down. But was this thing flying around before? No. It's the first time I've seen it. Well, sure. Normally, you can't see those things. <gasps> Neon! So, it was you we saw earlier. Huh? Earlier? On the way here, remember? We saw someone underground. That was... Yeah, that was me. It's been a while, guys. Oh. <gasps> oh, right. I remember you said it back by the seaside in Kobe. Yeah. Neon was the coach for Kansai's baseball team. That's right. That's why Kansai and I know him. What's the matter, Jenu? Nothing. Neon. Neon! I missed you so much, Neon! Neon! Yeah? Oh. <laughs> what? You seem pretty cold, even though it's been so long. Yeah. And you ran away before, too. Oh. Yeah. Well... Before that, can you tell me what that weird drone thing is? Yeah, sure. It's just a regular old monitor drone for protecting people. Normally, you can't see them because of the optical camouflage. B wait a minute, what's a monitor drone? Huh? It's like you guys don't know anything. It's true. We're pretty clueless about the whole world. We were asleep for a year. And when we woke up, the world was like this. Um... I got no idea what you're talking about, but... Let me try to explain. During the year you guys were asleep, the world... It became... A paradise. Paradise? And these guys were made to maintain it. The monitor drones, they were put in different places all over. Thanks to them, people can live peaceful lives. And the thing floating in the air and controlling them all is the Panopticon. You can't see them either, but they say they're shaped like an X. An X? Then we've seen it before! But the only ones who can see it are me, Pi, and Rachel. We couldn't see the monitor drones, but we could see the X? Maybe it's because the invisibility mechanism is different. The monitor drones use optical camouflage, but the panopticon is different. You can see the panopticon with your eyes, but the data's blocked from reaching your brain. Ah, so boring! Who cares about all this anyway? 
So, who's the jerk who made this Panticon thing? It's Panopticon. It means Omnipotent Monitoring System. Have you guys ever heard the name Mike? The one the Ehime cult believes in? Their god? Hmm. God. Huh. Well, it created paradise. So I guess you could call it a god. So that Mike person created the Panopticon? It's not a person. Mike is an artificial intelligence. An AI. <gasps> An AI? I don't know the whole story, but they say it was created by a brilliant Japanese scientist. And who's that? Beats me. Don't know the name. Anyway, that person is the one that messed up the world? Nah. They weren't directly involved in all the changes that happened. It was by Mike's will alone that this earthly paradise was born. Moldy, stinky underground of paradise! Yeah. Yeah. It just feels like humans are being controlled by Mike. Why isn't mankind resisting Mike? Resisting? Why would we do that? I told you already. This is a paradise. Why would we resist such a wonderful world? Besides, Mankind these days? They don't have emotions anymore. They don't have... emotions? Uh -huh. You talked to the people here, right? Then you should know. But why? Mike had the Panopticon send out tiny little doohickeys called nanomachines. They snuck into people's brains and cleaned out their emotions. To stop mankind from resisting? No, that's not it. It was to stop mankind from killing each other. Humans don't get angry or sad anymore. No more hatred, jealousy, or fear. So naturally, all the wars stopped. No more wars, no more murders. Not even stealing or any other crime. It's a true utopia. That's why I told you. This place is paradise. But if there's no emotions, there's no happiness or joy either. Of course not. What do you mean, of course? To give up the negative emotions, you gotta give up the positive ones too. It's like a trade-off, I guess. Did something happen to you too, Neon? Huh? Well, you didn't seem to really feel anything, even when you first met us all. Yeah, I didn't really feel anything special. Not happy or nostalgic, if that's what you mean. <gasps> You're lying! That can't be true! I mean, you don't seem the same as the others here, Neon! You're answering our questions, and your emotions! Seem to be like fragments or something. <gasps> hey, what's the matter, Chugo? Are you okay? She's burning up with a fever. I think it's an infection. Wait, remember Chuko was bitten by a rat in Cope? Do you think that's the cause? If that's the case, then it might be rat bite disease. We need to give her antibiotics or the worst might happen. Ugh. Neon! Do you have any antibiotics here? Beats me. What do you mean, beats me? Someone's life is on the line! And Shuko is your friend, right? Yeah, but... God. To be a true leader, you gotta think about how your teammates feel. No matter what happens, you protect your own. That's what a true leader does. Neon, you were my role model! I thought you were the ideal leader! But you're not a leader anymore! You're not even human! 
You're just... a lifeless doll! <sighs> you may be right. <laughs> this doesn't look good. At this rate, Chuka will really... Let's hurry! We have to find some antibiotics. Yeah! But where should we go to find them? I think there was a big hospital to the west of Nanzinji Temple. Maybe if we go there... Then first we'll have to go outside. I'll carry Chuko. Will you be all right? Hey! Who do you think I am? I'm the leader of the Go-Getters Club! All right, guys. Let's go! Follow me! Got it! Miss Jenu? Everyone left already! I know. Can I help you? <laughs> so, you did forget me. You remember Kansai and Chuko, but you don't remember me. <laughs> but I remember you clearly. I'll never forget, because you're... You're the one that killed my sister! It's all your fault, my sister! She... Why did you save me? Huh? You hate me, don't you? You want to kill me, right? Then why? Wait, so you do remember? Of course. There's no way I'd forget. Because you're... You're the woman I love, little... Uh, what's the matter? My... My head! It's gonna explode! It seems like I'm better now. Are you really okay? Nah. When I said better, I didn't mean that. I mean, my emotions are back. Huh? What? No time to explain. You hang on. I'll bring you what you need. What's this? It's a syringe gun. It's loaded with antibiotics. Antibiotics? So then, if we give this to Miss Chugo, she'll... Yeah, you should be able to save her.
here and we're going to have to basically control her and, you know, use her power. The rubble is blocking our way! What do we do? Well, what can we do? Oh, I know! Miss Jenu, when you saved that guy earlier, you used some kind of power, didn't you? Do the same thing now! The same thing? But I wasn't even thinking! The power just kind of came out! It'll be fine. In Jose Kizuka, they have a saying. Where there's a will, there's a way. Hey, why do you know that? I'm kind of a fan of Jose Kizuka, too. Whoa! Are you serious? Yes, very. Tell me, this minute, who's your favorite actress? Yikes! Calm down, Miss Jenu! I promise I'll tell you later, when we get above ground! Okay, you better. But for now, let me... All right, pretty obvious we are very familiar with this ability now because we have used it in that boss battle before. There is a sticker over here, okay. So I also, I'm also curious about this, how many we actually have. Um, because I know that I obviously have missed some since I haven't done every pathway. I think there's only one other part in the game where there is actually a different branch. It's, it's even earlier in the game. It's in sticker book over here. It says 19 out of 30, so we've actually missed quite a lot. Um, wow. You yeah, know, we seriously have. Okay, well, I mean, I don't know. Let's just uh, go ahead and gravity flip again here. So we just gotta be on the lookout for the ceiling, because in a certain area... Is that gonna fall? Oh my god, I thought it was gonna fall. ahead to make sure the path is clear but will you be okay don't worry about it where there's a will there's a way right chuko is waiting for us to come back with these antibiotics everyone else too okay got it miss jenu your powers are amazing i saw it earlier but to see it again it's crazy i can hardly even believe it Rachel's ability to throw, Miss Nero's F-bombs, they're all totally abnormal. And to top it off, Mr. Mochan can turn his body to iron, right? What is the Go-Getters Club anyway? Some kind of strange kid superhero group? I don't know either. Maybe it has something to do with the Panopticon and Mike. Anyway. We'll think about it later. Let's go! The other thing is that we actually already know a lot of this information. Like, we know why we have abilities. That was revealed to us later with Mike. And then we know that Mike is an AI already, even though it was revealed to us here. Because, again, you're supposed to be learning this stuff if you choose this pathway. Oh, great. Okay, so obviously don't use A button here. What the heck?
All right, I'm actually gonna end the video here because we are out of time. So before we end this video, I would like to encourage you to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I do post multiple gaming videos daily, so be sure to check out my channel. Bye bye everyone. Have a great day. Can I just go through? Go, go. What the heck? That did not work. It was still, I don't know, I'll figure it out next time. Bye bye.